Very well. I guess it's time to go gather some plants. This thing doesn't tell me about plants. Come on. Must bring the witch five white myrtle. I'm supposed to go to the inn and buy them? Ugh. Or I could buy the thing for 200 gold, but I'm never going to be an adept at making potions. I'll just go to the inn and buy those damn things. I guess. Maybe the alchemist has them. Maybe I can beat them out of him. Like you just beat the alchemist and he starts dropping herbs like... Dush, 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 die! Give me those herbs! You wanted to examine my body? Examine my fist in your face! Be alert! Be alert, what? Get out of my face, you idiot. Aha! There's a herbalist. Greetings. He's a fat Greetings. one, too. What a despicable place. I'm trapped here with my goods while my wife and children wait in the city. Why is that? Vizima's gates are closed due to the plague. The gods be my witness. Nothing ruins trade like an epidemic. I guess we just have to wait. Most of the diseased have died off, but the beast and bandits now spread their own terror. All we're missing are tax collectors. Can I ask you something? Yes? Show me your wares. So, white myrtle petals. She needs five of them. What a coincidence! There we go. Thank you very much for that. And now I can go back for the witch. Try a quest on map. Thank you very much. Friggin' FedEx quests, really? Come on. Damn, I'm thirsty. Get me to the interesting part of the story, please. Thank you very much. Oh yeah, I still have the art sign. I haven't even used it. Oh, I can't even use it now. How about if I draw my blade? I can't even draw my blade. Jeez. They won't let me just randomly draw my blade. Let's have a little word with Abigail. Abigail, here's your damn myrtle plants. What do you want? I gathered the myrtle petals. Excellent. Now to prepare the potion. How is it made? Interested in witch's secrets, are you? The recipe is yours if you swear to take it to your grave. I swear. Draw close and listen. Blend two ounces of cadaverin with the myrtle petals. Speak your name backwards, turn about three times leftwards, spit into the fire and stir the potion again. Complicated. <laughs> I knew witch's magic would be beyond the mind of a man. Grant me a moment to finish the potion. See you later. Come back later. I'm busy. You saved me, right? I helped. I wonder what will happen to me now. Waiting for your kin to come? No. My family has passed on. Sorry, kid. It's all right. I barely knew them. Oh, well. I should come back later. Wait a second. I can rest in there, can't I? Well, I should just go do some of the other quests. Let's see. Drowner contract. Ward for killing drowners. I'd like to know where the drowners are. 
Well, it's all the way up to the Reverend. It's this, the crypt. The crypt is probably where the ghouls are. I should head over there to the crypt. There's also a quest for killing ghouls, so I might as well go to the crypt and check it out while we're waiting on the witch to finish the concoction. There's a fireplace there I can light if I need to rest. Entering new region, path to the crypt. Crypt entrance, what's this? Witch's medallion, tip. Set the medallion to attack nearby monsters magic. If set to detect magic, the medallion will vibrate near places of power. To set the medallion, meditate and open the inventory, then select magical monster protection. What can I do at a place of power? You found a place of power, what would you like to do? What are my options? Perform the ritual of magic? I have no idea what that did. Well, here's the entrance to the crypts. I assume this is going to be like some kind of a dungeon. It's locked, so I can't go to the crypts. Damn you. But I want to go to the crypts. Damn it. Fine, we can't go to the crypts. Where else can we go? What's this? Campfire, campfire, campfire. Well, let's follow this, this road over here and do some exploring. We still have to wait, apparently, some in-game time for the witch to concoct her potion. But the thing is, you can obviously sit down at a fireplace and just say, uh, Oh, I'll just wait for this amount of hours and whatnot. But me personally, I'd rather explore a little bit, see what else is up in this particular section of the game. So let's keep going through here. Looks like there's a big gate over there. That's supposedly the city that's sealed off due to the plague. So during the day, there are no monsters. They only attack at night. Look at this. This is a monster right here. Terrible monster. Keep that thing away from me. Snap its head clean off. Now there is a door over here. Merchant's Bridge. Fireplace, locked, door. What about those drowner things? You'd figure that drowner monsters would be close to water, right? Suppose those guys aren't gonna land me into the city, so let's go through here. Let's try to make it to the riverbed and see if there's any monsters around that we can kill. There's supposed to be monsters here. Drowners. Can we go into the water? No, we can't. Wishers don't like water, it seems. Oh, yes, we can. This is a pretty nice water for 2007. Those are probably herbs, but since I don't know how to gather herbs yet, I can't really do anything about it. So where are these drowner monsters? I can't see any drowners in here. What's this? Sultan Chevet? Non-human scum? Oh, they're picking on the dwarf! You've gone messed up now. What's your business with this dwarf? We're shaving off his beard. What's it to you? You'd be better off moving along. Love non-humans, do you? Sheathe your weapon and stop waving those arms around if you want to keep them. Ooh, a live one! Game lads! Kill the deviant! You asked for it. They'll pack a carriage in your ass when I'm done with you. I'll pack a carriage in your ass when I'm done with you. That's what I'm talking about when I talk about dwarves right there. Don't mess with the dwarves, my friend. This guy has a lot of armor. I should just switch styles. How do you like that? I'm sorry, were you trying to attack me? Really? 
You shouldn't mess with dwarves, are you insane? Thanks for getting those hounds off my back. Wait, Geralt, is it you? Well, I'll be damned. Something wrong? You don't look well. Are you hurt? True to a witcher. Died, came back to life. Nobody's seen him for five years, and he wants to know if something's wrong. Who are you? Yeah, drunk. I'm your pal, Zoltan Chiri. Where have you been? Why haven't I heard from you? What about... Not sure I can explain much. Ah, you don't need to tell Zoltan Chiri anything. Let's just say I'm glad to see you. Though it would be nice to resolve some matters. You misunderstood. I lost my memory. I only remember the last few weeks. Hmm. Know what, Geralt? Let's have a beer and talk like we used to. Clear your mind and maybe some things will come back to you. You look like something's bothering you. Yes, a nasty matter. My friend was to meet me in this village some time ago, but he never appeared. Think he might be in trouble? I hope not. But I wouldn't be surprised if he were. He joined the Squirrels recently and agreed to trade with the Hawkers. Squirrels and Hawkers? The Squirrels, or Scoyatal as they call themselves, are non-humans who hope to gain equality by shooting folk from behind trees. <laughs> and Hawkers are merchants who sell arms to the Scoyatal. Illegally. I see. Geralt, I'm not exactly welcome here. We non-humans get blamed for everything from the plague, through the beast, to the warts on the reverend's arse. <laughs> I look for my friend myself otherwise. I'll keep my eyes peeled. Let you know if I learn anything. Thank you, my friend. So, how are you doing? You know me, my schemes. I hope to start a modest business in Vizima, bringing in goods from Mahakam. The Breckenrigs are pressuring me. The Breckenrigs. Who are they? My future in-laws. I'm to wed Eudora Breckenrig soon. But my father-in-law-to-be puts too much stock in material things. The common cause mine where I worked after the war was a complete failure. I blame it on the bloody times. I need to go, Zoltan. We'll talk later. Man, I... I missed, I missed this type of stuff in in Witcher because uh, he he I I forgot that he um he defends the non-humans as well and it's so cool that I got to see a dwarf. I mean you guys know me and dwarves. I'm just like I'm just really into dwarves. Nice box. Start a set of dice. Flint. Let's take all this. You guys won't really be needing it. Uh, we got some more remains over here. You guys won't really be needing any of this. I won't take rusty swords, thank you very much, but I will take all of your food. You should never mess with a dwarf. Uh, I'll drink a little bit of this. Onto the... As a celebration to the fact that we found a dwarf, I'll drink something. And... Well, I'm not really gonna eat. I don't need to eat. Thugs. It's really just... Bitch slap you. Wait a second, what's this? There's a quest here? I don't even know. Oh no, wait, this is for the for the witch, yeah. Maybe not. Oh, I'm that sword on your back could double as an oar. Oh yeah, I was looking for drowners, that's why I came here, because I, I just got so into the whole dwarven thing that I'm like, what was I looking for? Screw that. Dwarves. For the win. Wish you could be a dwarf in this game. Wish you could be a dwarf in every game. Poor girl? What the hell's happening here? You're it. <laughs> <laughs> Lol. I'll be a bar wench when I'm older. Oh really? That's your aspirations in life, a bar wench. Uh, what am I looking for here? Uh, what's this? The Reverend's house? Why do I need a Reverend's house? That's unforgivable. I need to find someone who can tell me more about these dice. Is that what I'm looking for? The Reverend's gonna tell me about dice? Really? 
You guys already know how I am when I do Let's Plays. I like to get lost in games, so I'm going to do a lot of exploring. This is going to be a long one. Speak quickly. I hear the Church of the Eternal Fire has offered a reward for drowners. As long as you can prove you killed some, I'll return with proof. Hurry. Why would I want to go to the Reverend's house? It's useless. Varangra's secret. Another witcher recently visited this godforsaken hole near Vizima. His name is Beringer, was not among us at Karamor, and what's more, he disappeared instead of facing the beast. I don't know him, but I can say that he's already made my life difficult by giving the villagers a reason to dislike us witchers. Can I... No, I can't mark this. Can't mark this either of monsters and men. I should probably go there now. Can I fast travel even? No, you can't. Uh, oh yeah, there's like a path through the middle of the forest here, so... I can just go through here. I think that the graphics, even, even though they're a little bit dated, I think the game itself still looks really, really good. It definitely keeps that medieval atmosphere that I love so much about RPGs. Ah, and I got to see a dwarf. That was awesome. Almost forgot that dwarves existed in the world of Witcher for a second. Hey, isn't there supposed to be like a faster path through the forest? Doesn't look like it. Damn. Oh, uh, yeah, there is. They're supposed to be able to go through here. Or so it seems, it looks like I'm gonna have to go around the forest. Oh yeah, and I leveled up. I should rest and meditate and increase my skills in beating people up. My mad skills of people beating. Let's go ahead and see the witch now, see what she has to say for herself. Doves flying all over the place. And the skybox is pretty neat as well. This is definitely a game that's worth the, the price. I would advise this game for people that are into the whole Witcher universe and still haven't played it. Whoa. One of those monkey things making weird noises. Stay away from me, monkey. I don't like you crazy monkey things. Onward to Abigail's hut. Abigail, you better be done now. I will beat you. What do you want? Is the potion ready? Yes. Alvin, drink this. Tastes bitter. No complaining. Now, speak. Abigail, I'm afraid. Why'd they skin the puppy? Why'd they hurt him? He was gentle. He hurt no one. And the girl from outside the village, she screamed horribly. Unlike any human. Bad children. Torturing the witch's puppy again. Innocent blood. Evil faces twisted by drink and desire. Plow her well. Show her you're a man. Bloodstained gold. The beast is born! Death. The final judgment. The beast has met its end once. It doesn't fear death. It is death. How will you defeat human villainy? With your sword? You who died and still walk amongst the living. Who has summoned me? Enough. This could end badly. Abigail, break the trance. As you wish. By the power of the seven spheres, leave this body. I compel you. 
Be gone! Oh, I'm sleepy. Mm. Alvin, go to bed. Geralt, another Witcher, Berengar, preceded you. He left these missives. Thanks. Farewell. Hellhound soul contains the formula potion made using the remains of the Hellhound. Uh -huh. Uh, where is, yeah, whatever, prophecy. What I wanted was what the other guy left behind. Didn't the other guy left something behind, a missive or whatever, is annotations about the beast? That's what I wanted to see. Damn it. Guess I'll just have to go to the Reverend's place. So, quests. Monsters and Men, Alvin's Prophecy, track on map. Let's go see the Reverend. Wait a second. Oh yeah, I guess this is the fastest route. Also, I think you guys can expect this playthrough to be a really long one, so I expect you guys to really support it, because otherwise I'm not sure I'll be able to continue it. Because according to what I've, I've, I've done a little bit of research, and I checked uh, what was the average game length of uh, Witcher 1, and the average game length is around 50 hours of gameplay. So 50 hours of gameplay is like 100 episodes. That's, that would be like the biggest Let's Play I've ever made, so... I'll need your full support on this, guys. Like, I'll need to get a lot of views out of this, because otherwise it won't be worth my time. Because it's definitely a huge time sink and a huge time investment. And I'm just telling you guys ahead that it's like, I'll need your, your true support on this. Otherwise, it's not going to work out. So, just to let you guys know about that. Okay, so let's go over here. And let's go ahead and try and have a little word with the Reverend, shall we? Curses! I agree. Curses! Whisk children away, turn them into witches. You should be ashamed. Simpletons all around. Damn, this guy looks old. They think of nothing. Speak quickly. Speak quickly. I know where the beast comes from. Was it summoned by the witch? The beast appeared because of human wickedness. To slay it, I'll need to identify the guilty. There may be wisdom in your words. When sheep run astray, the good shepherd must bring them back onto the righteous path. Otherwise, they fall prey to wolves. I'll learn all I can to defeat the beast. I must gather all the villagers. Here's your prize, Witcher. Two hundred arons. Thank you very much. It's time I dealt with Salamander. There are some things I need to do. Yeah, I agree. Get over here. Speak quickly. I'm looking for men who wear Salamander-shaped pins. That's not wise. Why? Vexing them may shorten your life. Do I look scared? Another Witcher came here before you. He too swaggered with audacity, and yet, do you see him? Not likely. He fled. He's not me. Do not sneer at Salamandra. The whole village fears them for a reason. You must convince us all. What can I do? For me, destroy the beast. As for the others, visit Odo, Mikkel and Haran. Can you solve their problems too? Are they elders of some sort? Everyone knows and respects them. Odo's rich, Aaron a merchant, and Mikkel a city guard. 
Gain their trust, and you'll win the trust of the village. We'll see. Wait. They need to believe I sent you. Show them this ring of the eternal fire. How about I set you on fire? Drag and drop signets into the highlighted slots to activate the signet gameplay dialogue. Left click the signet conversation to present the ring. Okay. So this is the signet. So I guess I'll need to slay the beast, but I'll also need to do a whole lot more. Gain the villagers' trust. I must first find, convince Heron, Odo, and McCool. Time to head out into that small village again. Here we go, FedEx men to the rescue! Yeah, there's a lot of boring quests that start. I hope this really picks up because... I mean, I realize that to me personally it's not that boring because I'm playing the game, but I mean... For you guys to be watching, it can get a little frustrating just watching me go from point A to point B. But you guys gotta remember, this is the game that a lot of you voted for, so... And again, I expect to be supported in this endeavor. So let's go ahead and see what's up over here. Go to Heron's house. Let's have a word with Heron. Heron Brog. G -g Greetings to the honorable gentleman. You are? Heron Brog, merchant and middleman, at your service. What brings you here, w Witcher? What do you have to offer? The re reverence sent you, I presume? Of course. W why don't I b believe you? Take that b back. The re reverence sent you, I presume? Of course. W why don't I b believe you? We'll talk later. How am I supposed to... Am I supposed to wear this? Ah, I get it. You're supposed to wear this and talk to him. Okay. There are... Of course. W w why don't I b believe you? The eternal f, -f fire A gift from the Reverend, I presume. The Reverend sent me. He thinks you need a witcher. I do. The d -d dead emerge from the river at the night. A ghastly cold blows from the water, making my flesh crawl. Help me. I'll s spare no exp expense. I'll help in exchange for information about Salamandra, and throw in 100 orans for my expenses. I heard you were looking for s Salamandra, but if so, you're looking for trouble. It's no m matter to me. You, you have a deal. These d damned undead are my concern. They scare customers off and d d destroy my crates. And this is a valuable shipment for a special client. Hmm. Listen, I found these strange dice. Looks like dwarven handiwork. N n not here. You want to get both of us in trouble? You're no saint. Afraid of a box? You have so much contraband in stock. <laughs> Survival instinct. I'd rather lay low. The Reverend detests this game. So you know what it is? I, I, I didn't say that. They're obviously not of human make and stink of de devilry. Best to ask among the dwarves. They must know something. Thanks for that, stink at least. Stink of dwarvenry. Of devilry, even. Must kill the drowners that haunt the riverbank at night. Okay, so we'll start a fire and wait until it's night time. And we'll get to level up too while we're at it. So, let's see. Uh, fireplace. Okay, time to acquire some of this new stuff. So, what was it that I wanted? Let's see. The strength too, I'm going to be needing at least position and regeneration, so I guess I'll get those. So position, regeneration, 
And what else do I got? Whoa, you get like 10 bronze talents? Why the hell am I getting so many bronze talents? That's weird. Either ways, maybe I should go into dexterity now so that I can start reflecting arrows. Do I have one in dexterity even? No. I need to. Reflect arrows and repel, but I don't really want to go there yet. I want to go to strong steel and fast steel, so... Oh, so this stuff stacks. So you put this one, then you put this one, and it gets 30%. Okay, I get it, I get it. Um, well, let's just put one here for now. And in fast steel, let's put it to level 2. Paralysis or hail of blows. Let's go hail of blows. And... You got four more. I'm not going into uh, the other ones yet. Let's go into intelligence. Because we already got potion bring. What was oh yeah, I need um, I need that herbalism thing. Yeah, that will come in handy. And let's go to stamina. Just put one in stamina one. And that should keep us going. And now let's meditate until... Dawn, meditate till dusk. Let's just meditate until midnight. And then let's go ahead and kill ourselves a whole bunch of drowners.